impossible. That is not, that is impossible. Stop. Go. Stop. Go. Stop. Go. Stop. Go. Stop. What is the problem, Sam? What's wrong with you? Gee, I have not slept in over a week. Just weird things are happening. I'm seeing things. Things are things are moving. Nothing's moving, honey. Just you see a doctor, you get some pills, you get some sleep, you're fine. I don't have to take pills. But if I don't get some sleep, by Friday I'm gonna be a complete fruit bag. Just thinking about giving this presentation to a, a table of suits air freshener executives. I'm afraid I'm like I'll puke all over them. <laughs> they'll really need their air freshener. Oh, that's an idea. I'll keep thinking. I know you can do this, honey. I know you can. Yeah. I invited my parents out in October. At the Maui? Yeah. Jeannie, we do not have that condo yet. Jim said once the presentation's no, over, no. the condo is yours. No, 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 no. Jim said if I aced the presentation, it was mine. He did not say that. Well, they already bought their tickets. Hey, big guy. Hey. You thinking condo, Sammy? Um, I'm thinking condo, Jim. When's the last time you slept? Well, I don't see how that's really, really relevant, Jim. You know what, seriously, when I'm not sleeping, I, I, I get so incredibly creative, seriously. And, and the, the, the idea is it's been pouring, pouring in. I can brief Chucky on the campaign any time. I mean, he's dying to get his hands on that condo. Like, Lucky Chuck? That wasn't a bad campaign. No, but it was nine nine years ago, Jim. I mean, he hasn't really had a, an idea like that one in a while. I'm thinking Clucky Chuck. No, 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 don't, don't, don't think Clucky Chuck. Time to wake up. Show's over. What is this place? It's a theater. Sir, come on, let's go. Oh, come Sam, on. actually. Prescott, right? Yeah. Yeah, what was that, that 
Then you get back into your car with the keys. I mean, that's, that's not really possible, right? Right, come on, let's go. But I, I wouldn't be able to do something like that, right? Evidently not. What is that supposed to mean? If you're so determined that it's impossible, chances are you're not gonna be able to do it. Yeah, but then why? Why is it happening? It's actually happening to me. It's rare, but it happens that way sometimes. It means that you're ready. Although it doesn't sound like you're all that willing. Oh, we're ready, ready for what? You're looking better. Ha, <laughs> yeah, yesterday I, I took your advice. Yeah, a little pill, a little cocktail works every time. Yeah, I'm yeah you. actually, uh, I was thinking about taking off again after lunch, if that's, if you don't mind. Oh, God, Sammy, whatever you need. But listen, show me what you're cooking up for Friday, huh? Yeah. A little preview, a little, <laughs> little me and you. Oh, yeah. Uh, Let's see. <laughs> oh. Genius at work. No, don't be coy. Oh, I see what you're doing. You're teasing me, I'm right? Just... You're giving me a little, I got to see a little something. A little something. A little show me something. What do you say? Uh, yeah. You know what? Hold that thought. I got to take this one. Ah. Yeah. Hiya. <laughs> Okay, Goldilocks, show's over. Time to wake up. Why was I out? That's perfect, because we need you out, like outside. Yeah, I'm sorry. I know you didn't want me back here, but this is the only place where I can sleep. Oh, I'm glad we're so entertaining. Let's go. How do you get up on, on this stage in front of all those people every night? You know, when you're giving gifts, you gotta be willing to get out there and offer them up. Me, I, uh, I give my gifts from around the corner. I don't need to be there to see it. Or take the credit. Exactly. Rule number one, gifts must be given, shared. There's rules? Yeah, there's a lot of rules. I live by rules. What's the rule? When you think you're going insane because things are moving around all by themselves, which is completely impossible. Rule number two, make sure your language agrees with your experience. I don't follow you. If you move something with your thoughts and then you immediately say that's impossible, you're in a bit of a bind, aren't you? Your senses experience something very real that your mind said it didn't happen. That can make a person feel loopy in a hurry. Matt Prescott, I gotta run. Savvy, thanks as always. Yeah, bye. See you. Yeah, that's all the way you were looking at her. How long you guys been, uh, been together? Oh, no, no, no. What? Rule number three, never, under any circumstances, let anybody know what you can do. Yeah, except for when you lock yourself out of the car. Yeah, or you're very late. But that, seriously, that's, that's rule number three? I mean, don't let anybody know? If you tell people the truth, they'll think you're crazy. Look at the way you're talking about it and you're actually doing it. I am? I mean, seriously, how do, you, how do you know? How do you know I'm not just, uh, you know, making this stuff up or that I'm nuts myself? Because everybody can do it. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a law. It's like gravity. So you're, you're telling me that, let's say, my wife, okay, she's perfectly capable of, of doing all this stuff, but if I tell her what's happening with me, then she's gonna uh, think I'm nuts. That about sums it up. And then you. You do a magic show here every single night, capable of waking people up to this natural law you're talking about, but you never let on, not even to the woman who you're obviously in love with, well, that you are able to move things with your mind. You make it sound so depressing. Uh. It seems it's the only place he can get any sleep. Glad we're so entertaining. Good morning. Some would say evening. What's been going on with you? Uh, it all started when I saw Prescott. He levitated some keys and I, I followed him here. Hmm. Doing magic at the grocery store again. Yeah, something like that. And since then, I've been trying to convince myself that seeing objects moving and floating around doesn't make me one sandwich short of a picnic. And all the while, he's telling me that it's, I don't know, it's all part of some, like, you know, natural law, like gravity or anything like that. You know? Now you lost me. Sam, well, let's, let's talk about rule number three, Prescott. In fact, I'd like to challenge that. Think about what this one rule could cost you. It's my rule, Sam. It's none of your business. Whoa. Did you do that? I did not. I did. I can't believe it. 
actually, I can. I did it. it. Looks like you got rule number two down. What rules? What's going on? Sorry, Savvy. I, I think I've dragged you into something that Prescott may not be ready for. That's about the most interesting thing I have <laughs> ever seen. And he did it without any wires? Prescott, how'd he do that? You think he uses wires? Well, yeah, that's what he said. He... You, you can move things for real? You've been able to do that all along? Are you kidding me? No. That is so incredible. Yeah. Prescott, we got a lot to talk about. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Come on. Hey, maybe rule number three is a bad rule. No, it's not a bad rule. You just need a little bit of editing, that's all. If you tell people the truth, some of them will think you're crazy. But not all of them. I would like to introduce you to a real clucky guy. A guy who is about to bring you a higher level of campaign. A uh, campaign, I believe, will go down in history. Hi, all. Uh, hi, Jim. Thank you for that yeah. introduction. Listen, um, will you just give us one more minute? Where have you been? I haven't seen you for days. You said to take some time. I got some. No, sleep. I didn't say disappear, Sam. You're off the case. Ooh. Chuck's here. God, I must be in the bathroom again. Yeah, we got this handled. Go home. No, no, Jim, but I, I have it. Honestly, I have it. I have the slogan. No, you know what? You don't get to just show up back here after this week and get the condo. Go home. Okay. Screw the condo. Please. I have the slogan. magic in the air. Freshen up air fresher. There's magic in the air. What the hell just... Okay, I don't know where you've been. But you're right. That is the slogan. That is it. Get the hell in there. Hello again. Thank you so much for your patience. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe that we are finally ready to begin. Now, as we've all heard the old adage, love is in the air. Honey, no wires? Are you gonna be able to do that? Yes, he can move things with his mind, but he's also a professional magician. He's been practicing oh, his whole excuses, life. Excuses, excuses, No, no, excuses. hey, I gave a presentation to a table full of some very intimidating people today, one rule at a time. Right. Okay. Rule schmools, what did you think of the show? Oh, I thought it was amazing. Gorgeous. Yeah, did you sleep well? Are you kidding me? I was wide awake for the whole thing. Mm -hmm.